Today we will be going over some basic techniques to assist a person who is blind. First, let's start with hand placement. It is appropriate for someone who is taller than you to place their hand on your shoulder. The elbow is appropriate for someone who is the same height or slightly shorter. The wrist is appropriate to lead a child. Never lead someone by holding hands, walking too far in front of them or dragging them along, or by linked arms. When you see someone who you think may need assistance, ask them. A person who is blind may not always need help. If they do need assistance, introduce yourself and ask which arm they would like to be led with. Let them place their hand before walking away. When you are leading someone, be as descriptive as possible. Stop before you make a turn, right or left, and let them know which way you are going. Tell the person where objects are so that they are more familiar with the environment. When you do this, they become aware of their surroundings and in turn, more independent. When leading through a doorway or a very narrow passage, inform the person you are leading and have them slide their hand down to your wrist. This lets them follow directly behind you and clear of anything that might be harmful. Here are a few things to remember. Always ask if they need assistance, never just assume. Do not lead by holding hands, linked arms, or walking too fast. Tell them about their surroundings by being very descriptive. When leading through a door, make sure they move their hand and walk directly behind you.